Today, I don't know why, I'm just, I'm here, I can't sleep, I am all jacked up and just needing something to do. I thought, you know, why not? I've been talking about or wanting to check out some of these acting challenges on TikTok, check out some of the performances by people on here, and give my thoughts, give my critiques, see if any of them are any good, uh, see if they all suck, I don't know. I'm sure that there are some talented people out there, actors just trying to gain some kind of notoriety, just trying to express themselves, trying to keep their craft sharp. There's, there's there's oh, a ton of reasons that somebody who wants to be an actor would be on a platform like TikTok. So I'm excited to sort of just jump in. I basically just went to TikTok, typed in acting, and then acting challenge came up. That seems interesting. We'll give it a look. If it's not what we're looking for, we'll move on. But yeah, let's uh, let's let's jump into it. Should I roll the intro? I could roll the intro. So, Watch me cry on cue. Here we are. Watch me cry on cue. Okay. You gotta give me something. You gotta give me something. That's a talent. That's definitely a talent. Very good. Very good. Very beautiful young girl. I'm sure she's she's uh, uh, working hard trying to make something happen. That's it's very tough. I'll, I'll say this. So crying on cue is not easy. It's not easy. There there are two two things I'll say about this. I'll say it really quickly, and then we'll just move on because this kind of crying on cue, it's a talent. It, it's definitely a talent, but I got to be honest, to me, for me, for me personally, seeing somebody do this is sort of akin to, you know, like like party tricks, you know, somebody who can like, who's double jointed, who can twist their arms around. It's a, it's a party trick and it's fine. It's great. It's a great skill to have in your back pocket as an actor. Don't get me wrong. But there is a, a line, a difference between being able to generate tears and being able to generate sincere emotion. Two very different things. She did a decent job and it seems more like a physical thing that she's just doing. I didn't really feel the emotion build in this particular instance. Of course, there's no context. There's no build up. There's no dialogue. There's no story. So it's difficult to judge that he or she may very well in a moment in a scene have that kind of, uh, uh, have that kind of depth that kind of sincerity, authenticity, all that stuff. You just can't see it here because it's just its just a few seconds in front of a camera generating a tear. It's not... It's fine. It's impressive. But its it's not really... I'd like to see her, like, act. I'd like to see her in a scene. I'd like to hear some dialogue. I would like to see some kind of emotional journey. I'd like to, I'd like to see her act. What's next? Acting challenge. You're the blue line. I got a question. Perfect. You've heard of Olive Garden's unlimited soup, salad, and breadsticks thing, right? Well, I was thinking, there's no way they have an unlimited amount of the soup, salad, and the, uh, uh, the breadsticks. Yeah, breadsticks. So okay. I was thinking, we should go there, we should figure it out, you and me, see if they really have an unlimited amount. What do you say? Uh, okay, uh, Olive Garden. You, me, soup, salad. Yeah, breadsticks. Whatever it is. What do you say? Okay, so this guy was. I think that this was. I don't know this guy. He, you know, I, I don't know anything else that he's done. I'm willing to make a prediction though. I would bet dollars to donuts that he is either in or has spent m many, many months, maybe years, in improv troops because the 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 mannerisms, the the urgency that wasn't really like earned. Uh, um, the sort of manufactured urgency kind of feels like an improv troupe. Like I, I, I get it, the comedy he's trying to hit. It's a cool deal. Is this what the acting challenge is though? Cause I might be in the wrong place. This isn't really what I'm looking for. So let's try something else. Here we go. Let's give this a try. Why? No. You're the killer. No, I'm not. Liv, no, no, stop. No. Liv, no. just stop. Mm. Fuck you, Amber. I'm not the fucking killer. I know. Welcome to Act I'm gonna watch this again. We're gonna watch this again. You're fucking lying. No. You're the killer. No, I'm not. Liv, no, no, stop. Liv, no. Liv, just stop. No, okay. All right, so here's something 
about this. So so she may very well be very talented. Actually, one, one of the pitfalls of TikTok and doing TikTok things when 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 around when, when it's sort of centered around actual skill that, that you have to develop is that I think the temptation to just put a bunch out and not really do it really well is really heavy. My first thought, like if we ever come to a place where the the world of film and TV is subject to things like this, these really short, like if this ever becomes people's reels, these little TikTok moments, then in that case, if I were a casting director or a director and I'm looking at this young lady for a part in something that I'm producing or directing or have written, and this is what I have to go off of, what I would see is someone who doesn't put in the time. Because, okay, it's a TikTok video. Maybe they're all like that. I don't know. I, I really don't spend any time on TikTok, so I don't know. Maybe they're all like this, but she obviously doesn't have the dialogue, the timing down Hat because whenever it gets the, it hits that intense moment, she's behind. It, the, the the dialogue starts and she has to catch up. And the problem with that is that it's an intense emotional moment. That's when the emotion sort of kind of hits its peak, its climax. And if you're playing catch up, it's gonna look really fake. So just take a look at it. Just oh, behind no. the dialogue. You're the killer. Right. No, I'm Liv, stop. stop. Here. Yeah. Liv just stop. It, she gets into the words uh, just before she even starts moving her mouth. And it, it just, that's what I would see. If I were a casting director, would I cast her? Probably not. I don't know what to say beyond that. Let's take a look at the next one. No, I don't buy sad. I still see sad. I, no. Okay, here I don't really get sad. Not genuine sadness, anyway. Right there, I still see sad, angry. Like, like I'm, I'm so upset and sad that this is happening. Scared. I don't get scared. Her. I get more like uh, put off. And the, the lip syncing was completely off there. That threw me completely. I can't even judge the last bit because the lip syncing was so off that it just uh, it just throws me. That's my thoughts around this young lady here. I, I think that, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, would I cast her based on this video? I would need to see more. I would ask for something more specific. It still hurts. I'm I moved on. I feel bad on. about what happened. So you're apologizing. Yes, I'm sorry. Okay, I don't forgive you. Herb, I said I'm sorry. Yeah, and I do not forgive you. Okay, Feel all right. About what happened. This is good. This is really good. Would I cast based on this? Yes, absolutely I would. I, I think I would. I think that uh, at the very least, she would get an in-person callback for sure. So I'm oh, loving, loving this. So on the left here, just focusing on the it still hurts. So you're apologizing. Yes, I'm sorry. Okay. We're getting I a lot of action you. here. Herb, I said I'm sorry. Yeah. Here. And I do not forgive you. The right muscles are tensed. Feel We're getting sort of so the right transition. Apologize. We're following around yes. on, along on the right path, the right journey. Okay. I'm getting broken hearted. I'm getting at, you know, like yeah. obstinate. Like I'm, I'm, I'm so hurt <laughs> that I'm not going to give an inch. You don't get to be forgiven because you've broken me. I'm getting that from this side. Now from this side. I feel bad about what happened. I'm seeing a little bit of so lack of preparation on this side, or, or, yes. or at the very least, she's missing some of the dialogue. Okay. I don't forgive you. Herb, I said I'm sorry. Yeah, and I do not forgive you. Right there, she missed hey, the dialogue. Yes, I'm sorry. I love this. Okay. I, I mean, I would need you. to see more. Obviously, Herb, I, I would need to see more, but, yeah. but from the and little head bobs or, or, or shaking, hey, feel bad the eye rolls, about. What happened? The eye contact. What's interesting is so that she took the apologized. same basic gestures. She yes. looks in the same directions around the same time. Okay. I don't forgive you. But she did Herb, so I with such a different intention. Yeah. Intention is so important, uh, especially with with uh, camera work when acting. I say that, but it's just as important with stage work. But intention is so important, and she is giving such clear marks on both sides. Very different. Just look at the faces that I've got paused here. Look at the pain on this side. Look at that pain. The eyebrows tensed and turned upward on the inside uh slightly slightly squinting tension around the, the mouth over here so slack eyes wide open looking straight ahead very relaxed indifferent it's very good high marks yes she gets cast for sure 
how TikTok wants me to act angry, how acting angry should be. Okay, this is going to be interesting. So what it sounds like and then what real acting is on the other. If that's what she's doing, I'm very excited. We're going to take it back and start all over. I'm angry. You know, I'm getting totally screwed over here. Uh -huh. The deal was that if I win the Hunger Games, I get to live the rest of my life in peace. But now you want to kill me again. <laughs> well, you know what? Okay, so two things. One, if this is what TikTok wants, then it's not It's not acting. That's not acting. If this is what acting, she does a very good job. There is, it, it kind of falls off a little bit for me, right, for the last two lines or so. I really wanted a little more there. For the, you, know, you can't put everybody in here. It kind of died. The energy in the, in the, because it's a quote from a film, it's audio from a film. The energy in the dialogue stayed up and hers kind of fell down a little bit. I would have liked to have seen her keep that up, but it's lip syncing. I don't, really know how much you could judge someone's acting talent based on lip syncing, but it was an exercise that we used to do, that we had to do. I'm sorry, my sinuses are bothering me really bad, guys. But right here, what you'll see on one side, there's nothing going on. It's completely blank. It's it's small, it's weak, uh, and it's non-committal. On the right side, you're seeing big choices, you're seeing full committal, and you're seeing genuine emotion. I think she actually did some real scene work for this one here. But now, right there. you want to kill me again. There it is. Eyebrows. <laughs> All in here. I would say to go further. You know you can't put everybody in here. I liked it. I just I would tell her to go further. I would tell her to go further. There's still a little bit of not wanting to go full stink face on it, and I think that you need to be able to be willing to look disfigured to be able to look contorted to, to to not worry so much about that and i feel like maybe there was a little bit of that here i imagine that's a big problem whenever you're doing a lot of things like this because you're constantly seeing your own face it's not bad when you're working on movement to work in front of a mirror but in my opinion when you're working on emoting you should not necessarily always stare in a mirror you need someone to work off of or someone to watch and judge what emotions you're communicating because when you're looking at yourself in the mirror we're all susceptible to vanity you can't worry about being pretty when trying to work a scene one more we'll do one more if i play do i get one of those cool t-shirts <laughs> yes really? tiktok Everyone actors be like we make them ourselves what's with and the eyes so much happening with the muscles you're being sarcastic so much happening too if much play, happening okay you do not need that much there's an actress in in the tv show buffy the vampire slayer her name is charisma carpenter and i talk about how she does so much all the time with all the muscles on her face you do not need that like chill chill with the eyes well she's lovely told me, stay away from that aren't yours. doing a lot doing an awful lot nice transition that was a nice emotional transition, but she's doing way too much. See all the, all the, all the things happening. Look, look at it. Look at it. What's happening here is you're, we do not experience emotions in that way. We don't experience sadness, fear, anger, sadness, fear, anger, sadness, anger, fear. We don't, they don't come in steps like that. When we experience emotion, it's either layered or it's always layered, and it flows in transitions. There is a journey to our emotions. We don't bounce back and forth between being angry and hurt and frustrated and sad. We can mask, but this is too much. We don't do this. What masking looks like is if, you, if you're sad and you're masking that sadness with anger, then you're angry, but there's a sadness left. There's something in there that even though you're showing anger, you're, you're demonstrating how how frustrated you are and how much you're, how, how, how fed up you are. There's still something in the back that no matter how hard you push and you try and how much you yell and how much you scream, there's always some sadness, just a little bit of sadness. And that's not something that you can do. You can achieve by faking it. You can't achieve it by just contorting the muscles of your face. You know that when you're sad, you look like this. And when you're angry, you look like this. So you just go back and forth from those things. You can't do that. You have to find the emotion naturally internally and allow your body to simply react to the emotion. Allow your body to simply react. If you try to do it the way it's being done here, you end up with this. You end up with a lot of movement 
on the face, but not a ton of movement coming from inside, not a ton of uh, 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 traveling being done emotionally. This is a good one to end on. I think that that she potentially could have a, she could have a lot of talent. I don't know if this is a, a product of TikTok, a product of the platform. This might be what they mean by the way TikTok wants us to act or what TikTok actors are like, but she really just needs to calm this down. Emotion, good, good, good. There's a journey. Nope. Nope. I, anger. Fear. Sorrow. Anger. Distress. Sadness. Grief. Anger. Vengeance. It's just all over the place. They give me something consistent. It's all over the place. So I don't know exactly what she was going for here. And that's the problem, kind of. I don't know what she was going for. I should be able to either say this is what I got or that's what she was trying to give me. I really should be able to say that's what she was trying to give me. And what I got was all over the map. It was it was kind of it was kind of insane. Okay, that'll do for now. Thank you so much for watching this. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Check the description for all my social media links, uh, the Patreon, Discord, buy me a coffee, all that stuff. That's all I have to say. Remember, everybody out there, please be kind to each other. And most importantly, be kind to yourself.